We're drinking buddies and we like to drink. 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 Town dog, let's drink, let's drink. Town dog, one, two, three, four. Let's drink. Responsibly, sir. All right, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to another fan fun filled fact packed episode of your favorite show and mine. Army, Army drinking, drinking buddies. buddies. My name is Brian Robertson. As always, my good friend Tori Murphy. Tori Murphy. And today I'm back in Portland. Uh, we shot a couple of episodes a few months ago, or a couple months ago, or maybe a month ago. And I'm back. And so now we're going to try something completely different. So what do you got? Well, it's called the business, and so kind of a riff on the uh, bees knees. The bees knees, indeed. And so probably, one of my favorites. I love the bees knees. I enjoy many drinks that have honey syrup in them, yeah. and this has it. Nice. So, a uh, pretty simple cocktail. Three ingredients. Gin, lime juice, and honey syrup. Easy. And uh, we got this recipe from the book, um, Regarding oh. Cocktails by okay. Sasha Petroska. Very nice. And uh, if I butchered his name, I apologize. It's page 85, by the way. Page 85. It's fantastic. <laughs> Both highly recommend it. Go yep. get it on Amazon. Beautiful. It's actually, it took me several weeks to really? get it. So kind of... It's rare. It's a rare, rare book. Exactly. Awesome. But it's, it's worth the search. So uh, Cool. So how's it, how do you put it together? So we're going to use uh, two ounces of gin. And so I'm going to say the single recipe amount. Gotcha. Um, but we're making two here, so uh, this is not two ounces of gin. This is actually four ounces of gin. Yep. And uh, just kind of a, a nice gin. We're going to use number 209. Nice. From San Francisco. Delicious. And then um, one ounce of lime juice. Fresh lime juice. Squeezed moments ago. Exactly. On our, or my, citrus assassin. The citrus assassin. It's pretty brilliant. And then uh, three-quarter <laughs> ounce of honey syrup that I made just a couple minutes ago. Beautiful. So I That's apologize. Easy. I put it in the wrong part of the tin. That's okay. But, uh, You'll survive it. Hopefully, the drink Nazis will not arrest you. Yeah. <laughs> You'd be surprised. Take it. Eight. Nine. Eight. So you shake from eight to ten seconds. If you shake less, it's not going to be cold enough. If you shake more, you're just wasting your time. Exactly. Beautiful. And so these glasses, we chilled them. Pour it in and try not to drool at this point. So what is the fundamental difference between the bee's knees and the business? Lemon juice. It's the citrus. Okay. And so according to this book, um, the recipes in this one, they're, they're both two ounces of gin, one ounce of citrus. So the bee's knees has one ounce of lemon, lemon and this has one ounce of lime. Beautiful. And then three quarter ounce honey syrup in both. I'm down. I'm down. Let's give it a shot. We'll give it a shot. Ooh, it's nice and cold. Cheers. Cheers to you, sir. Ooh. Mmm. Smells different. Ooh, that is oh. gin. That's some gin, and the lime definitely comes through on this one. Um, you know, I find with cocktails with lemon, uh, the lemon is there, but I, it's forgettable for me for the most part. It, it, it's such a common flavor, but the lime jumps right out at you. It's good. Oh, I like it. Oh, and then to... the honey you use, lots of honeys have different flavors or yeah. whatever, so I probably wouldn't go with the most bland, bleach bland <laughs> honey. If I go get a little crazy, yep. experiment, because the honey will uh, interact with the botanicals mm. in your gin in different ways. So That's good. If you don't like it with one gin, try it in another. Indeed. I can't see it. It's kind of a, um, it's almost a milky I wouldn't even say green, but it's it's not really yellow. It's sort of, it's almost a, a light brown. Yeah, it is super refreshing. It is. It's fantastic. On a hot day, it would be amazing, and it's nice and warm today. Hmm. I'm down. So obviously, give it a shot. Make it yourself. Tell us what you think. Uh, you know, add your comments in the comment section. And uh, any other comments from the peanut gallery? So you don't have to get number 209 gin. Right. I think kind of any sort of mellow gin, so Plymouth gin, um, Tanqueray, Aviation gin. Nice. Um, will kind of right be good. And if, if you like Beefeater and, and uh, Sapphire, 
Give it a whirl. Give it a shot. Anyway, so uh, we here at Army Drinking Buddies are always drinking responsibly, and you should too. So drink this drink, tell us what you think about it, and we'll see you on the next fun-filled, fact-packed episode of... Army Drinking Buddies. We'll see you next time.